quickly how to solve for y in this equation y squared minus y to the power of 3 is equal to 12 solution then here we have y square minus y to the power of 3 let's bring this 12 to this side because minus 12 is equal to 0 then this can be written as y square minus y to the power of 3 minus 12 can be written as minus 8 minus 4 is equal to 0 then this can be written as y square minus y to the power of 3 minus 8 can be written as minus 2 to the power of 3 and minus 4 can be written as minus 2 square is equal to 0 then let's compare this to this and this to this then here we have y square minus 2 square then here is minus y to the power of 3 plus 2 to the power of 3 is equal to 0 then take note of this that from here if you have a square minus b square this is equal to a plus b bracket a minus b then also from here if you have y to the power of 3 plus z to the power of 3 this can be written as y plus z bracket y square minus yz plus z square also if you have a to the power of 3 plus b to the power of 3 this is equal to a plus b bracket a square minus a b plus b square where a is equal to y and then b is equal to 2 now let's start with this y square minus 2 square is y plus 2 bracket y minus 2 minus here y to the power of 3 plus 2 to the power of 3 this is y plus 2 bracket y square minus 2 multiplied by y plus 2 square is equal to 0 and this is y plus 2 bracket y minus 2 minus y plus 2 bracket y square minus 2 multiplied by y this is 2 y plus 2 square that is 4 is equal to 0 then y my y plus 2 is common here and y plus 2 is here let's bring it out we have y plus 2 bracket if you divide this by this we have y minus 2 minus if you divide this by this we have y square minus 2y plus 4 is equal to 0 now here is y plus 2 bracket here is y minus 2 minus multiplied by y square that is minus 
y square minus times minus 2y. This is plus 2y minus times plus 4. That is minus 4 is equal to 0. There are two cases here. The first case is y plus 2 equal to 0. And the second case is here we have minus y square. Then y plus 2y. This is plus 3y. And here is minus 2 minus 4. That is minus 6 is equal to 0. And from the first case here, y is equal to minus 2. This is the first value of y. Now from here, let's divide all through by minus 1. If you divide everything by minus 1, we have minus y square min divided by minus 1. This become y square plus 3y divided by minus 1. This is minus 3y. And then minus is divided by minus 1. This is plus 6 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula. And our quadratic general formula is giving us y is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a. And from this equation, a equal to 1, b equal to minus 3, c equal to 6. Then, y is equal to yeah, minus bracket minus 3 plus or minus square root of minus 3 square minus 4 multiplied by a is 1 multiplied by c is 6 divided by 2 multiplied by a is 1 y is equal to minus times minus 3. This is plus 3 plus or minus square root of minus 3 square. That is 9. Then minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 6. That is minus 24 divided by 2 multiplied by 1. That is 2. Y is equal to 3 plus or minus square root of 9 minus 24, this is minus 15, divided by 2. Then y will be equal to 3 plus or minus square root of 15, multiplied by minus 1, divided by 2. Now y is equal to 3 plus or minus square root of 15i divided by 2. Therefore, y2 is equal to 3 plus square root of 15i divided by 2. And y3 is equal to 3 minus square root of 15i divided by 2. Our final answers are y1 is equal to minus 2, y2 is equal to 3 plus root 15i divided by 2, and then y3 is equal to 3 minus root 15i divided by 2. You can see that from here, we have two complex roots. Two complex roots. This is complex root. And this is also a complex root. The only real root we have here is this y 
is equal to minus 2. We can check to confirm if this answer is right or wrong. Let's check. To check, we have the given equation y square minus y to the power of 3 is equal to 12. When y is equal to minus 2, here we have minus 2 square minus bracket minus 2 to the power of 3 must be equal to 12. Then here minus 2 square that is 4 minus bracket minus 2 to the power of 3 that is minus 8 must be equal to 12. We have 4 minus times minus 8 this is plus 8 must be equal to 12. 8 plus 4 this is 12 is equal to 12 which is true. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye. Thank you.